In this class, we'll run remaining two operations in FTP connection that is delete a file and move a file. I will clone an integration which we had previously created and name this as test FTP and remove this number from here. Click on clone, edit the integration. Here, let me add FTP invocation and provide the name as move FTP. Click on next. Here, we have to select the operation as move a file. Here, we have to give the source directory path file name which it has to move, target directory path where it has to move the file and the target file name. If you select this overwrite file, then it will be overwritten in the target directory if same file is present. Click on next and done. So in the mapper, you have to just pass the details if you get from somewhere like the variables. In our case, we are getting the details like source directory. Source directory, we have to map to this directory, file name to the file name, target directory to target directory, target file name to target file name. Based on this, the file will be read from this directory and written to this target directory with the target file name. I'm closing this. Suppose if you have to delete a file, say I want to delete write integ.csv file from FTP. In that case, we have to call this FTP connection within our integration. Name this as delete FTP. Click on next. Here we have to select delete a file operation and provide the directory from where it has to delete and the file name. Also, we can overwrite those values from the mapper like how we have done in other cases as well. Go to mapper. Here we can pass the values what file we have to delete and from what directory like this is the directory and this is the file name like this we can either move a file from one directory to another directory in FTP server also we can delete a file in a particular directory in FTP server with the help of FTP connection.